Center for Neurotechnology, creating access for all. Access ERC is a project funded by the National Science Foundation. It's actually a supplemental grant to the Engineering Research Center at the University of Washington, also funded by the National Science Foundation. And there are about 15 of these centers across the country. And we were funded to help the other centers recruit and employ and engage individuals with disabilities in everything they do. When we are organizing events, you know, we try to make them accessible to all. We ask people for their accessibility needs. And I work really, really hard to make sure everybody feels comfortable um, with whatever they do need. The website is the first entrance into our program, into what, what we do. And if, if that population cannot access it, what, what good is it? So another aspect of the space that we really enjoy is the flexibility in the furniture. We can set it up in many different configurations uh, to engage uh, users, but we can also clear it out of the way if we have an event uh, where many people with um, assistive devices are, are present. Um, it's really an element of universal design. I've worked in diversity for quite some time, and um, sometimes the conversation about diversity can focus very much on one or two particular groups, in part racial minorities and women, and not as much be discussed about uh, persons with disabilities. ERCs are designed to have huge impact in society by solving some of the major challenges in engineering uh, that society is currently facing. And in order to have that kind of impact and to solve these important problems, we need to include every section of society, including people with disabilities in all aspects of ERCs. To learn more about how you can incorporate accessibility and universal design in engineering research centers, visit the Access ERC website hosted by the University of Washington. washington.edu slash doit slash programs slash Access ERC. Access ERC is a supplement of the Center for Neurotechnology, National Science Foundation grant number EEC-1028725. Any opinions, findings, and conclusions or recommendations expressed in this video are those of the authors and do not necessarily reflect the views of the National Science Foundation. Copyright 2022. University of Washington. Permission is granted to copy these materials for educational, non-commercial purposes, provided the source is acknowledged.